Five federal COVID dollars for school systems across the state will run out later this year, but education leaders say don't panic. In fact, they said they had not only a plan to keep systems afloat, but they think this could actually be a positive for first year teachers. Bria Chapman's live at five with why, Bria? Yeah, that's right, Jonathan and Jen. This is big news. So state superintendent Dr. Eric Mackey tells me the funding the state received will run out by December, but they have already allocated money in the state budget to replace it. But unfortunately, some schools could still lose reading and math coaches and some other programs. But Mackey does not want educators to worry. He says there will not be any massive layoffs and they expect to see a record number of educators retire at the end of the school year. Now, some of those positions will not be replaced, but there is some good news in the governor's state of address earlier this year. She talked about increasing the pay for teachers in Alabama to be the highest of all the states that surround us. Now I asked Dr. Mackey about it and he says that could soon be our reality. If, if uh, the legislature holds with it, it will be a starting salary of a first year teacher right out of college with a bachelor's degree of 47,000. Uh, I think it's $600, and that will be the highest um, starting pay of any of our surrounding states. And, and Yeah, really good news for teachers out there. So now if this passes, that will be more than a 7% increase for first year teachers. And the governor has also included a 2% raise for teachers for in K through 12 and those who teach at the community college level. Jonathan. Thanks. New equipment for fire.